at the tone, six hours, zero minutes, coordinated universal time. Welcome to the channel of Victor Echo Fine, Juliet Lima. In today's video, I'd like to share how I fix my Uniden BCD996 XT. This is a great scanner and many people have it. The problem with this one is the keypad is acting up. I hope this video can help you if you're experiencing the same problem. The radio hasn't been used manually for a long time as I use it mostly by remote control via ProScan. I've moved my scanning station from my man cave into the house and I haven't needed to manually lock out a station in a long time so when I tried it, it didn't work. As you can see here, I get no response when I push the menu button or the lockout button. But I can press the WEX and priority button and they work. I thought maybe it had something to do with key lockout settings in the software but that wasn't the case. I really didn't want to open it up and I wasn't sending it away for repair so I did some research. I should have done that research before I did the factory reset but hey, lesson learned. I discovered there was a common problem with the internal cables, especially the ribbon cable. Disassembling the radio would be simple by removing four screws, or so I thought. This is how I think I work, but that's not the case. I just didn't want to bore you with the unscrewing of the case, so I sped it up a bit. I'm very impressed with the double case on the unit end. Well, it means I need to take off four more screws. It does have amazing shielding. Once I removed the second layer, I had to remove the speaker wire, and that's simple enough. Once I did that, I carefully inspected all the wire connections, especially the ribbon cable, which is the suspect. I put the radio back to where the power was so I could test it out. There is no speaker or antenna, so you will not hear any noise or see any signal. I just wanted to make sure that it was fixed. Works great. All functions are back to normal. So what I did before I finally assembled the back piece to make sure it's all working is I managed to plug it in. I did get the menu to work. As you can see, so it's that's still working. I plugged the um, speaker back in. The antenna here is really crappy, so that's why the signal is not good. But you hear audio, and there is a signal. So now I put it back into service, got the box back on, got it all fired up, cleaned up. The only problem is now I have no frequencies in it because, of course, I wiped it trying a factory wipe. But the nice thing is now that the that's the most important thing is that that switch works. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can tell when I've uploaded new content. I do appreciate it. 7-3. Take care. From Victor Echo 5, Juliet Lima.